In this quick video, I'm going to show you how you can fix the issue if your Sync Module 2 is not connecting to Wi-Fi, one you can try to do. So there are two things that you can try, maybe they are going to work out. The first thing that you can try to do is when you get it plugged in and everything is going to be working, you want to press and hold reset button on a Sync Module 2, you can have find right here. Or on a Sync Module 1 is going to be right here, the small button. But when you have Sync Module 2, it's going to be here. Now, what you want to do is like pretty simply, you want to just press and hold it for about five seconds. And then in the front, the light will go to the red. If the red light is going to begin to flash. A blinking blue and a solid green LED will appear, indicating the Sync Module 2 is now ready to set up. Now, maybe this is not going to work out. So what you need to do is to solve this issue, needs to do something else. So first you want to unplug device. So unplug it for about 30 seconds, okay? Then you want to take a pen and you want to press and hold this button right here for about for for after 30 seconds when you're going to unplug it, you want to press and hold the reset button and then you want to plug it again, okay? So you're going to plug it again while you're holding the reset button. And what will happen is this. Continue holding the reset button until you see a flashing red light on the SM. Once you've seen the flashing red light, you can release the reset button. So you see the red light, you can release it. And after resetting the SM, wait patiently for the solid blue light to change back into the solid green blinking blue light pattern. This pattern means the firmware has been reset on the SM and is ready to reconnect to the Wi-Fi network. So this is how it works. And that's something you can do. Tap on the Sync Module icon located in the bottom of the home page in the Blink app, then select the Change Wi-Fi Network option from the list displayed. And it's just going to set it up, the standard process. But this is what you can try to do. So, put it, put it out, wait for 30 seconds, then you're going to press and hold the reset button, you're going to plug it back in, then you're just going to see a flashing red light, and then when you're going to see that, just release the reset button. And that's pretty much it. So, thank you very much for watching, and have a great day, and goodbye.